Hey guys, today I just have five easy gift baskets that you could do for the holidays or for my case, I'm doing this for our Christmas party we're having at work. I was put in charge of making five prizes and my budget was $25. So I really tried to get some good stuff for these prizes. So, but yeah, we could use these for the holidays. Um, you can obviously get cuter boxes to put it in and cuter paper, but I had a budget and this, these are Capri Sun boxes cut in half. <laughs> but anyway... So here are just some ideas you guys could use for um, some easy, quick holiday baskets. And you can put these in stockings or cute little holiday boxes that they sell at the dollar store or just wrap them with cute paper. But here's mine. So for the first box, it's kind of like a baking box. I got these all at the dollar store. This is just like a Betty Crocker. I think this is like how you ice the cake. I used another Christmas box just to hold this up. So I have some icing, a cake... I got this at the dollar store as well, measuring cups and cookies. So this box was $5 because it was a dollar for each item. But it's just an easy, you can do an easy, um, you know, baking kind of basket for somebody in your family that loves to bake or something. And yeah, you can put it in a cuter box or, um, you know, put put like, like an oven mitt and put like this and this in an oven mitt. And that would just be like a $3 kind of gift. But yeah. So here's my first box that I did, a baking box. Here is the next one I did. And I got this cup at the dollar store. They have a lot of holiday cups. I got these at the dollar store as well. My mom loves these. And I just stuck them in there. And I just cut the top off of the box. And I got these at Rite Aid. They're $1.99 and they're buy one get one free. So I paid $1.99 for the two. So I got one milk chocolate and one French vanilla because it sounded fancy. So I did do this one. And that was just like an easy way to use the box instead of buying like another box to put it in or something. I was just trying to stay in budget. But you know, they'll still appreciate it. You know, after they open the gifts, nobody keeps the wrapping paper. My sister actually tries to save a lot of it. <laughs> She's one of those. She likes to save all the like bags from like bridal showers and baptisms and stuff. She like keeps all the bags. Okay, so this one I got I got the bath bombs at 99 Cent City. So these are their, uh, the three a three count. This one's called Unicorn Tears. And this is just like a, a bath time box, if you will. And this one is called Pineapple Splash. Those are three. They had a mermaid one and another one there. But I grabbed these two because I liked, I liked the picture on them. They're cute. Okay. And then I got this at the dollar store, Dollar Tree. And it's a collagen face mask. I got the hair wrap. I got it in pink. Pink. It's a hair wrap. And I think it's microfiber. I hear that's better for your hair. Um, and then I got like a sponge. A pink sponge. So then this basket was also $5. And then I used the my son's Capri Sun boxes to um, hold the stuff in. So that's that box. Okay. And for this box, this is like a pedicure, nail set kind of box. And so what we have here are just some cotton rounds. And I got those at the dollar store. And then, you know, some nail polish remover from the dollar store. Let's wait for that one. <laughs> I also got this at the dollar store as well. I think it's for your feet. Yeah, Petty Tool. There we go. Oh, yeah. Get those feet nice and soft. I got a little Petty Set nail grooming kit. So it comes with all this good stuff. And I got one of these. I remember using this when I was in high school. I thought it was so fancy. I was like, oh, let me just file my nails during class or something. Anyways, so I got this at the dollar store as well. This, um, I actually have this jar at home. I have a bunch of these. And then I used the nail polishes that I had got at Rite Aid on Black Friday. They had, hold on, let me find it. They had these boxes on Black Friday at... Rite Aid for $2.99, get $2 back in points. So it only cost me $0.99 cents for these. And I have four of them. So I just opened up one of them and got a few of the nail polishes out and put cotton balls to hold them so they wouldn't just, like, do that constantly. And I just put those in here in the mason jar. So for this box, I think this is the one that cost me the most. So this is one, two, three, four, five. I dropped it on the floor. And then $0.99 cents for the... Um, what is this called? Nail polishes. This one called me cost me $5.99. <laughs> but I thought it was like a really cute set. Like you could give this to like a niece or 
you know, a sister who like loves doing their nails or something, put it in a cute box or in like a bag. So that's this box. Okay, and the last one I did was like a movie night box. I wanted to get one more thing to put in here, but I just, I thought, at my dollar store, they usually have Blu-rays right now because it's Christmas time, but they were sold out of them. So maybe I'll get some more, I'm not sure. But for now, it has, I got the popcorn box from dollar store. This pack of popcorn for a dollar. I got these ones, are the ones from uh, Rite Aid that I had gotten for free on Black Friday. But they do sell Sour Patch Kids, it's just not this big of a bag at the dollar store. And I got these at the dollar store. Yeah, that's my last box. So that one cost me like four bucks. Okay. So yeah, that's everything I got. And this, um, everything together cost me just about $25. It was like $24.98. But yeah. So these are really e easy little boxes or like bags you could put together. If you have a bunch of, like a lot of family. Or if you're doing a raffle or you need prizes or something. These are like really easy, not super expensive. This is basically five gifts for $25. <laughs> so yeah, I just want to make this video really quick because I had all the stuff together ready and show you guys. Okay, so have a good holiday. I can't wait for Christmas.